The blessings and mercy of God be upon you all. Today we have with us Brother Logan Griffith, and he is going to tell us a little bit briefly about what sparked his initial interest in Islam. Logan, tell us. My first initial interest was just general curiosity, and then from there just kind of sparked into watching videos, emailing questions to imams, and then one night I just decided to say the Shahada just to see what it felt like, and from that I had a religious experience and decided that Islam was for me. Now you received a free copy of the Qur'an at the Islamic Center in Asheville, North Carolina, correct? Yes, I did. What part would you say reading the Qur'an played either in your journey to Islam or in your, um, after you had become Muslim, increasing your faith? After I became Muslim, it helped me connect with it more and understand it a little more in depth because I had a lot of uh, things, but the Qur'an definitely went more in depth and do some of the questions I had asked or some Excellent. of the basic knowledge I had. Um, do you have any words of encouragement? Because you know what we do at Furqan is we try to make sure this Quran is freely available mm -hmm. to the American public. Do you have any words of encouragement to your fellow Muslim brothers and sisters? Um, my encouragement would be that it says to do Dawah in the Quran and I believe there are probably some Sunnah and Hadiths about it too. And I feel that it's my duty to portray Islam in the way that it should be to dispel any myths and misconceptions that people may have about our religion. Well, Logan, thank you very much for your time today and for giving us this opportunity to film you and find out a little bit about your story of how you were guided to Islam. May the peace, blessings, and mercy of God be upon you. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. And you too.